question 7. The points P and Q have coordinates minus 2, 6 and 4, minus 1 respectively. Given that PQ is a diameter of C, find the coordinates of the center. Easy. So center um, will equal the midpoint of A, a mid midpoint. So it's going to be 4 add on minus 2 over 2, comma, 6 add on minus 1 over 2, which gives 2 over 2, which is 1, comma, 5 over 2, which I write as 5 over 2. Um, we add the midpoints. Yeah, so in this case that's right. 1, that, okay. Show the equation is that. Okay, so what's the equation of the circle? Well, we want the, we should need the radius. So the length of PQ, so PQ is equal to the square root, the difference between the x's, which is 4 minus minus 2 squared, plus the difference between the y's, which is minus 1 minus 6 squared, which equals 4 minus minus 2 is 6, so it's 36. That's minus 7, so it's 49, which equals the square root of 9 out of 6 is 5, carry 1, so it's 85, root 85. Okay. So PQ is 85, so the radius, the radius is equal to root 85, root 85 divided by 2. That looks a bit odd really. So the equation of the circle is x minus the x the center which is 1 squared plus y minus 5 over 2 squared is equal to the is equal to the radius squared which is root 85 sorry which is which is root 85 over 2 that's the radius squared and I think I must have made a mistake somewhere here the midpoint it doesn't look anything like their answer so it's minus 2, 6, 4, minus 1. So the center is, we add, we add the x coordinates. So it's for, that's 2, 2 over 2 is 1, 6, and that's 5, 5 over 2. Okay, maybe it's right. Okay, so this will be x squared minus 2x plus 1 plus y squared minus now that times that would give 5 over 2y so double that would give 5y so that's going to be 5y plus 5 squared is 25 over 4 is equal to root 85 squared is, is 85 2 squared is 4 okay so we've got x squared plus y squared minus 2x minus 5y plus 25 over 4 minus 85 over 4 equals 0. This looks more promising than I thought so I think it's going to be okay. So it's x squared plus y squared minus 2x minus 5y minus 60 over 4 60 I missed the one up so that's 60 over 4 is 15 and I've forgotten that one so I've got to put a 1 here 1 plus so add the 1 to there so that's then right so it's x squared plus y squared minus 2x minus 5y minus 14 equals 0 which is what we're supposed to show. The point R has coordinate 2, 7. Show that R lies on S. Okay. 
so we've got two comma seven. So left hand side, left hand side. So it's going to be two squared plus seven squared minus two times two minus five times seven minus fourteen. We don't know what that equals. We mustn't put what that is. So this is four plus forty nine minus four minus thirty five minus fourteen. So that's fifty three minus thirty nine minus fourteen which equals naught by magic. The right hand side equals naught and therefore left hand side equals right hand side and therefore two comma seven lies on lies on circle. You have to do it left hand side and right hand side. Hence state the size of angle PRQ. Well PQ is a diameter. Right, so PQ is a diameter. They've told us that. So it doesn't matter where R goes, doesn't matter where R goes, that's bound to be a right angle. Bound to be a right angle. So P R Q equals ninety degrees. Show that R lies on C. We've done that. And hence state the size of the angle. Um, I'm going to put angle in a semicircle just to make sure they realise angle in in semicircle. That will do, I think. So that's number seven finished.